We are back. I think we are back. Hold on. Okay. Sorry for the other video. It was a catastrophe in my point of view. It's just that the sound was all off. Oh, no. No, Alora. Okay, so... <clears throat> yeah, my other video was a complete uh, disgust for me because of all the audio. And I didn't notice that being in a um, uh, glass paned room would cause all of that audio to just sound like it was like I'm under the ocean or something. Which is funny because, you know, today in these levels we're going to be under, really under the ocean. Well, if you know, like, Faria uh, Towers, I think we're, we might get to, uh, for sure. I could go do that one first, honestly. It doesn't matter. See, that's the thing. It's like all the other levels in Spiral 1 were just linearly placed for you to do them in like a certain order. I mean, it really didn't matter, but they were there. There were only three for each world, but now it's like in this game, all the levels are barely, barely spread out, which is cool. And then there's so much peace, like the soundtrack is just amazing. It always makes me question. Way, He's collecting talismans to help us defeat Crypto before he can take over Avalon. Oh! It always makes me question, like, because there's a uh, like, all the worlds in this in this game are based off of the seasons, but they don't have a spring, which is again why you know we should probably add a spring in the remake. Like that Spring Savannah project, that's amazing. Again, it's just me playing, like... I'm trying to control my... my tone of voice, you know, to make it sound more... more peaceful to the... to the ambience of this level... of this world, so... Yeah. I meant to do that. Spyro, you see this? Again, we could skip mini bags, but I'm not doing it because it's just not worth my time. have uh crushes dungeon in, behind that door so we're gonna try to finish all the levels first before going on there. I'm gonna go ahead and do her cost because the title of the uh of this video is um as you can tell spaghetti and meatballs there's a reason for that, and it's in this level, so <laughs> I'll explain it when we get to it. By the way, this is one of my uh, more favorite levels. See, like the audio still messes up, but it's one of my most uh, one of my favorite levels in Spiral Two. Always had trouble with the gear grinders. I so there's that theory that these orange uh, gear grinder things, if that's what they're called, and their robots are based off of, uh, or were used to base on base Ratchet and Clank off of. 
is also, you know, it's also in Zomniac, so I wouldn't be surprised if that were true, but if not, I don't know if it's, it is or isn't. I mean, this level portrays my mood at the moment, so I like it. <laughs> That was weird. Get this ring going over to me. Pretty. Just remember that every thunderstorm, there are the sun's always behind it, so there's always light behind this thunderstorm. And now I'm being poetic. See, there's a, a glitch, you know, the, the jumping glitch, which can just make you, you know, take you right up this ledge so that you don't have to go through the, all the wonky other parts of the, the orb mission, but we're just doing everything straight to the point. It's like the, the like a, excuse you? <laughs> Like a regular player, you know, like a first tiny player, that's how I kind of play this game. And then I think I do a good job at it, since I'm getting, like, you know, whacked on the head by a ring. You can see the gem sparkles through the through the wall. Mwah. I was contemplating erase or uh, deleting my the for the reverse video for the second game, you know the one my most recent one, uh, because of just all the audio. Like I didn't know how bad the the like the external audio was gonna be like in the video. Like I'm, I apologize. Like I think there like the very first part you can hear like. You can hear my my sides and stuff, and the uh, like. I had my keys next to me, so like those were really loud on the table, and I didn't know it was gonna be that loud. And then there, I think there's like elevator sounds also because I was in the hallway behind a glass door or glass uh, um, glass windows, and um. That's what probably made the, all the noise. And I apologize. I was thinking of just erasing it, but then I was like, sorry, I need one. I was like, it's all just part of the experience. Just what the heck? I'm just trying my 
my best to at least start like you know live streaming with by playing games before I do anything other any other major thing. So it's all just a big experiment on my part. So might as well just leave it. And that's why I'm just doing this. See, because I would also like this do like you know a playthrough without like my own comment commentary. But uh, there's been other people who have done that already, and um, to the maker of the video, it would sound better to talk during the playthrough. But I know a lot of people don't enjoy it. But I'm just one of those people that you know talk while they're playing. So I mean, I'm talking less now than compared to my other videos, but. And in the softer, I guess, lower tone also. So I ranged a lot in uh, the first game. I don't know, it's just that the mood of this level makes me feel, you know, the way I feel, the way I'm feeling right now. Fine. All oh, this is fine. I love the game. Okay, ah, I was about to say something. So it's been like roughly a week since I've uploaded. I'm probably gonna stick with just uploading like early in the week <sighs> because. Um, or whenever, I guess. Whatever. Okay, he, this is where the spaghetti and meatballs come in. These things right here. Hello. I know, I understand your pain. Okay, so this used to like creep the heck out of me when I was younger. Uh, this little mini game here. Because if you listen to that little elect electro troll, whatever it is, um, you find out that those like blue things, like these blue things right here, um, they're trying to steal the the little electric balls, the, the electroids, whatever they're called. <laughs> and I used to think. That the reason they were stealing them was, yeah, maybe to get the electricity in it, but also so that they can eat them for some reason, I don't know, for some reason I was thinking of it, that they would steal them whenever the alarm went off. Dude, I like that just like cynical little laugh when they take it. Like that scares me. Like, that they would like take the balls, and if you weren't fast enough, they would disappear and take the the little balls forever and eat it like on a plate of spaghetti and use them as meatballs. That's what that's what my four year old little mind thought, and I was just. Traumatized by the fact that one time I couldn't find the last like ball. Like once it was all over, once I killed the thieves and stuff, I couldn't find the last little ball. And I was always thinking, oh no, I missed one and it stole the ball and now it's eating it and I'll never get it back. Thanks to my horribleness at playing this game. Like I literally said that to myself and I was traumatized by it because I would think that they would just 
I don't know that they would just escape with him and take them forever, and I was just creeped out by that. Especially because this level is pretty dark and rainy and gloomy. I was just so scared of that, that I had failed the mission or whatever, and I was just so scared. See, like, this one, this one was here right now, but now it's over here, so, like, I used to think that maybe they just, like, jumped somewhere else or disappeared and then just ate the little electric balls, and that's what I... That's why this is called electric uh, spaghetti and meatballs because I used to think that these little balls were meatballs for the for the thief things. No, 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 they're just butts and annoying you as cake. Plus, whenever the alarm went off, like back then, it used to scare me the crap out of me. Also, like oh my gosh, and it kind of still does today. Whoa. This is what I'm just gonna do. Okay, they're all dead. They, they don't steal them. They just take them and run off like annoying rats. But it's okay. They're, they're all dead. And they'll never come back ever again to haunt me in my, in my dreams. Thank you, Spyro. I found this shiny thing mixed up with our lightning stones. Please. Take it as a reward. I like the sound of um, when the orb is like coming at me. Like I like that too. I don't see nothing. I see the sun. <sighs> oh, I missed a gym. I meant to do that. I missed two, actually. Um, I mean, <clears throat> another thing I like more in this game than the first is that uh, Sparks isn't messed up anymore. No, Sparks is not the traditional Sparks that I remember as a kid. Not the, you know, big eyed uh, mosquito that it was in um, Inspired in the first game. Sorry, Sparks. Thank <laughs> you. 
my brother, when he played this level, he did not, um, talk to that little guy that I just talked to, and he did not get the orb. And then when he realized he missed an orb, he thought like it was the like the end of the game because like he and he just like quit playing it. I think we were in Autumn Plains by then. Ah, oh, crud. Which was kind of messed up. I mean, like you could have just gone back and gotten it, but so whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Just one orb. The struggle of a perfectionist. See, I'm a perf wanna be perfectionist in other things. I mean, I still am with uh, with Spiral. You know, I always want to shoot for 100, percent but I'm more laid back about it now. Why do I keep doing that? But perfection does not exist, so don't try to aim for it. You should aim for reasonableness, honestly. I mean, always try to be the best, but just know you won't ever be the best, you know? Because... Um, There's so many things I want to talk about, but I don't want to talk about them because then I would like make spiral of log, and I don't want to do that. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can do this. Ah, See, this is the kind of things that I struggle when I first played this game, and now because of these keys, I'm struggling again. And mostly because I'm getting impatient. Okay, I get it. No! Ah, oh, see, I hate it when I misclick a key and because of that I don't jump and I just keep moving forward. See because like I'm just I meant to put Z since Z is the jump key. But I either push X or A or something else. Because me and my dumb so like so you push A to hover. But you have to jump first before you can hover. Ugh. Why is this so hard? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna wait on you. I'm not, I'm just gonna wait. There, I'm not missing you. Focus. Oh yeah, and there's skill points here too. And there's no skill points in the first game, so... Yep. What? What? What just happened? What? <laughs> I don't know what just happened, but... I fell, that's what happened. Just like I fell right now. Oh god, that scared me. <laughs> See, I hate that alarm. It still gets me all the- every time. Like, ah. I need that alarm on my i on my iPhone. So I can wake up early every day and not be late to class. Yeah, I'm in college by the way. Undergraduate freshman. Okay, 
me. <laughs> Let's try that again. Oh, stop. It's laughing at my, um, it's mocking my, my simplicity of this game, which is pretty simple, but it, oh, God. What? I hovered that time and it did not work. I feel like this is rigged. Spiral, please. Stop. Why do you do this to me? <laughs> okay. Please just let me make it now. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll help you. Thanks for shutting down the factory. You're welcome. Okay, we did it. You think? Oh, uh, don't. Oh gosh, that was that caused a headache. Okay, we're done with spaghetti and meatballs. I always like those little animations. I think they're unique. They give each level of extra personality. I don't think they have those animations in the third game. They just really should have like put them in. Oh, I don't wanna do Sunny Beach. I don't know. It's, I think it's too slow for me. This level is too slow for me. We're gonna skip it. I just don't like this little game. I think those like grandpa turtles are just hideous. And then the babies, like, I like that they're pretty cute, but they're like annoying also. I don't know. There's like cute. See, there's different levels of cute. There's cute, like, oh, adorable. And then there's like cute as in like. Oh, that's cute. And then there's cute as in like annoying cute where it's like ratty cute where you just want to like. I don't know, like rip the little whatever the cute little thing is. Like rip its head open or something, that kind of cute. You know what I mean? Like annoying cute. Yeah, and I think that they're annoying cute. So I don't know, this is me. I mean I mean they're cute. But ah oh, they're annoying. And again I pushed X instead of Z. I don't I don't really like Sunny Beach. Between Sunny Beach and Seashell Shore in the third game, I prefer, much prefer Seashell Shore. I don't know, I just don't like the music for this. I think it repeats too much. And it just gives me a headache. Even these little starfish, they give me a headache. I don't know, something about this level, I just don't like that. 
It just gives me a headache. And then that turtle game, that, that always gives me a headache. See, it fits in, because that's soup. So, like, that could be, like, the spaghetti, the turtle soup, and then the meatballs could be those electric things. So, I put a perfect title. Don't mock me. I mean, the alarm in her class can mock me, but stop hitting me. Oh my god, and the enemies, like, they're ugly too. Like, those ducks, they just annoy the crap out of me. See, this is why I don't like this level. It's so dang slow. I mean, it's a cute concept, but again, what kind of cute is it? It's annoying. And the sad part is, is that we're gonna have to, um, come back to this. Because we don't have the ladder ability right now. I mean, there's a, a chance to skip it though, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. What the fuck is that? Okay, whatever. You're ugly as fuck. And then their voice is like, oh my god, those, like, you heard the, the voice of that, like, old ass, I mean, old man, old ass heck man, there we go, um, or turtle thing, whatever, gosh, I just don't like this level, I just want it to be over. <laughs> this and Robotica Farms are just... Gross. I just don't like them. Shut up, you don't. Oh my god. I mean I'm not gonna do the 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 jumping glitch. Like I can barely do it on the PS controller. Like I'm not gonna be able to do it on here. And I don't wanna waste my time even more in this level, so I'll just have to come back. What the? See, those are cute too, but they're annoying cute. Everything here is annoying but cute. Still, I don't like. Stop. Get your butt out of here. See, we're gonna have to come back to do this. Oh, shut up. I hate your voice. Like, oh my god. It sounds like you're in pain. Or like, like, it sounds like the voice is cracking, but it's an old guy. So then you're like, a turtle thing, old human guy turtle thing. And then you're like, how can your voice be cracking? Like, you sound in pain. Like, I mean, they ripped you out of your shell, and now you're just floating above it. Like, you must be in pain. Just like I'm in pain in this level. Oh my god. See, and this turtle, it has a unibrow. I don't know if you saw it. It has a freaking unibrow. Like, to top all the... I just don't like this level, period. I don't want to get out of here. You're welcome. The sad part is, is we're not done.
Hard to control. This is the tricky part of the castle. Have to, have to, have to. Hmm. This level is a pain if you want to skip many bags. But we're not going to, so that's okay.
Yeah, you don't want to go in there. <laughs> Again, we have all the signals, the parts of all the signals. Mm-hmm. 
Let's go to the team. Oh, almost there. Mm, if I get a five, I'm gonna skip my first one. Oh, I'm gonna skip this. I skip this here also. Two thousand two hundred and eight. How about two thousand three? How about two thousand three? Yeah, I know. Mean, yeah. Two thousand three. If you can make it to the top. Yes, I mm -hmm. ah. It's going to be a pain. And there it is. my new pet man. I think it was farting or something. But I don't know it is.
Okay, my sister couldn't do this on the PS, but she has no excuse. I just did it on the computer. Six is a doozy, oh my god. Did I just say that? I sound like an old person. Oh, I guess I thought it would be. You did it. Now we can. Yes, I did it. Okay, this is the last thing I'm doing for this episode. Before you get into the castle dungeon, Spyro, I thought that you might want to...
pretty easy. Still misses him. The Ripto has caused enough damage. All his meddling has cost me a fortune. Okay, I have to leave this on just to see. <laughs> Just voice over. That's the end for episode two. Thanks for watching.